All right, what is up, you guys? I am at FYE, and this is where I usually go if I try to get DVDs early. So, you know, I haven't been to FYE in a while. I don't really come here anymore. You know, I used to be here at least, like, three times a week when I was younger and when I started collecting. But, you know, I don't get my new releases here. I get them at Walmart at midnight. So... I can usually find early releases here. Whenever I usually do get early releases, it's here. So let's go in and try, see if we can find anything. Obviously we're pretty much looking for Best of Raw and Smackdown for 2018. So let's go in there and see what happens. Okay, so, update. They did not sell it to me. As you can see, I had it. You know, I had it. Um, the Best of Raw and Smackdown 2019. And the reason I went looking is they usually have early releases earlier in the year. Usually like January, February, they'll put them out early. I don't know why, but they just do. So, you know, I went in. As you can see, I found it. Uh, they had some other good DVDs there as well, but, yeah, I took it up, and they said it's not supposed to be out till February 12th, and they can't sell it to me. So, the way I see it, you know, I've worked retail, and the rule was always if it's out, you gotta honor it. <clears throat> it's just like, you know, if you have an old sale tag up, you gotta honor the sale. You know, I'm not gonna be all pissy about it, I'm not gonna bash them, I just don't. I think if you have it out, if you fuck it up and you have it out, just give it to me. Who cares? You know, like, I just don't know how you can put it out accidentally. And this is the only time I've ever had this problem. You know, I've been here countless times to get early releases. Never once had an issue. So, I don't know if it's just the manager there, or what. I mean, I used to know everyone that worked at this FYE, and they all left. So now it's people I'm not familiar with, so I don't know. But, yeah, that sucks. I mean, I could always try again tomorrow, but at the same time, it was overpriced. You know, I can get it at Walmart for $19.96 on the release night. Or I can get it here for, like, $26 or $27. So, yeah... I mean, let me know your opinions on this. You know, I'm about to go film a DVD hunt, so look forward to that. For now, this has been the DVD Freak. Peace out.